Hello dear all beautiful students welcome all to our today's session once again we already started the chapter wise SQ on the basis of that items we already started chapter 7 and 2 class on SQ types of session is going on there and also uh, today already we have done many of the SQ and today also we will go through another SQ, uh, SQ session first of all we will try to understand in which form in which form carbon dioxide transport to lungs number 2 which gas Which gas in plant in plant produce day night? Number three, Through which part? Through which part? Plant receive plant receive gas from water. Number four. What is the first part? Which one is the or which is the first part? Which is the first part of respiratory system? Respiratory system. Number five. Which part extends from which part extends from larynx larynx downward larynx downward in the thoracic cavity in the thoracic cavity number six what type of membrane what types of membrane present inside the tracheal wall tracheal wall number seven what is bronchial very important very important sq types of question we have written today also as like as the previous time uh, we have seen that uh, some of you like jawad Korim, savin uh, then farhan safiur rafsan arnob all of you alaikum salam very good morning and welcome to the class in which form carbon dioxide transport to lungs we know we know the answer but it is very important bicarbonate form 
बाइ कार्बोनेट फॉर्म बाइ कार्बोनेट फॉर्म द कार्बन ट्रांसपोर्ट टू द लंग्स नॉट डिरेक्टली कैन गैस कैन नॉट डिरेक्टली कैन बी ट्रांसपोर्टेड टू द लंग्स डिरेक्टली कार्बन डाइऑक्साइड नो बाइ कार्बोनेट फॉर्म व्हिच गैस इन प्लांट प्रोड्यूस डे नाइट येस वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग बट वेरी इजी क्वेश्चन डे नाइट डे नाइट मीन्स इन डे एंड नाइट कैन प्रोड्यूस बाई द प्लान in the plan okay so it is also a very known question but sometimes it can be missing if there is no option that times it can have chance to be missing out that is the carbon dioxide so hope so you understand this one about the carbon dioxide can produce in the plan in denied through which part plan receive gas from water Through which part plant receive gas from the water? Yes. Many of uh, you will uh, do the mistake by uh, this question. Why? Because through which part plant receive gas from water? Gas from water. You think the gas? Gas can be absorbed by uh, maybe leaves, aerial parts can ab absorb and trap the gas. like that you can think about that aerial parts of the leaves are like the stem bark maybe that one. but the crucial point is water from water it is root through which part plant receive gas from water root which part root from the water okay or in the air that means the aerial parts so this is the crucial point of remembering and understanding okay water number 4 which is the first part of the respiratory system everyone know that but sometimes i have seen in very last year when i uh, give this type of uh, question i have uh, seen that the some of the students only uh, uh, write there which part respiratory system they write the nasal passages someone write the nose actually the respiratory system having uh, that parts or that kinds with knowing uh, that which one is the respiratory system? nose i didn't uh, think about the nose is there how it is nose can be uh, incorporated on there on them how can we uh, write about that respiratory system if it is asking first part you will write the nasal cavity nasal cavity cavity the whole nasal cavity is the first part of the respiratory system someone write the nose nasal passages like that no so if it is asking in this way you will try to go through understanding on a specific part now uh, number 5 which part extend from larynx downward in the thoracic cavity can anyone give the answer simple question simply you can give the answer also i have seen uh, many of you also joining here uh, okay fine mahmud sifat nahyan aditto muntasir fuad arnob already jiaul kazim alaikum salam and very good morning everyone till the answer of the question number 5 i already uh, told you my dear students and uh, maybe tomorrow uh, in which time we will meet uh, in the zoom class uh, class no actually in the zoom meeting i will announce in the uh, group so everyone if no one knows know them ensure them and do yourself also having a zoom meeting okay so by the way our question was in that times uh, which part extend from larynx downward in the thoracic cavity larynx downward in the uh, thoracic cavity can anyone the question number 5 5 question number 5 larynx downward to thoracic cavity trachea simple larynx downward thoracic cavity trachea is the answer trachea trachea is the common answer for them 
Yes. And what type of membrane present inside the tracheal wall? What type of membrane present inside the tracheal wall? If it is asking for, what will you write? What types of membrane present inside the tracheal wall? We know that the below, uh, around the lungs, that is the uh, pleural membrane. In the uh, uh, any kinds of uh, skin layer, we have seen also in any uh, human outer skin. But what types of membrane present inside the tracheal wall? Inside the tracheal wall, what type of membrane are there? Can you anyone? Why you didn't write or why you don't? Uh, know the answer it is these types of question are very important and if it is asking in the exam so uh, what will you write on the time so what will you write if it is asking for what types of membrane present inside the tracheal wall so dear student write uh, uh, in the comment i want to see can anyone yes mucus membrane or no abedin very good correct answer very importantly it is the correct answer what types of membrane present inside the tracheal wall it is the mucus membrane very very important mucus membrane mucus membrane many of the student many not some many of the student didn't know about that the mucus membrane so it is very important mucus membrane okay another one is the definition bronchial 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 we know that when there is a pipe like a structure on there in below we have seen just normally there is a branch like a structure we have seen okay there is a inside it this is the branch suppose these are the branches and also have the sub branches branches and sub branches the sub branches inside the look at here the total branch when which one is look like the branch and make the formation of the alveolus at the top of balloon like structure that is the alveolus branches are the bronchus sub branches that can carry out the alveolus that can carry out the alveolus sub branches that can carry out the alveolus are called bronchial look at here very importantly i tell you someone write the sub branch of bronchus no. no yes of course that will be but there will be the great answer of getting the good marks you can be uh, thinking about that uh, inside the uh, lungs when we see some branch like structure is uh, spread uh, that branch like structure is the bronchus but sub branches those sub branches can carry out the alveolus or balloon like structure or air sac at the top point that are known as the bronchiole many of you didn't write in this way many of you can write the sub branch of the bronchus is the bronchiole of course i will give you the mark but when you will write the branches can enter into the lungs and can be separated and divided into many sub branches that can carry out the air sac or alveolus that is the bronchiole so that will be the great answer of you and teacher will be very impressed for seeing this one okay by the way uh, what we are uh, going on through in which form carbon dioxide transport to lungs by carbonate form i have written there which gas in plant produce day night day and night both case carbon dioxide through which part plant receive gas from the water very important i told you when in in the form of water plant absorb it through roots remember in air aerial parts leaves or like other parts which is the first part of the respiratory system not nose i was surprised when i see the many of the student write the nose nose no nasal cavity is the first part of the respiratory system which part extend from larynx you know the larynx to thoracic cavity is the trachea which type of membrane very very important this one in asking in lots of time not only in uh, uh, ssc exam it is also for any uh, competitive exam also 
what type of membrane present inside the tracheal wall it is the mucous membrane mucous membrane is the correct answer very important this one and what is bronchiole don't write about that the sub branch of the bronchus you will write those branches can enter into the lungs the known as the bronchus and the sub branches can hold out the alveolus alveoli or air sac that is called bronchiole so we learn another uh, uh, seven question and in this way every chapter wise we learn many of the sq types of question chapter wise we learn so uh, uh, that will be very helpful when you will carry out and ensure the note of you and before exam you will just open no need to go through the book for sq or sq types of question just open the copies note copies and learn that will be very helpful for you so that's all about today everyone stay safe stay sound and before completing the class i want to say uh, tomorrow's meeting can be remembered by you and you can remember to other students also thank you allah hafiz